Good morning guys and welcome to another geocaching adventure here on Geodudes. More of a milestone geocaching adventure today. If you guys uh, recall about 12 months ago now, almost we're approaching it, on January 1st I went out geocaching and my goal to this year was to hit 700 geocaches found. Uh, what your New Year's resolutions are for the year. Uh, I guess mine would be geocaching wise. Um, I think I want to try to hit 700 by the end of the year. 2019. I believe I'm at 530-ish right now. I am currently at 685. Uh, two weeks from today will be January 2nd, so I do have some time, but I thought, just so I don't pressure myself too much, uh, I found a power trail that I can go hit up and get those remaining 15 caches and hit number 700 today. So let's go do that. Let's go find number 700 today. I'm sure we will because there's about 70 caches on this trail here, so uh, let's see what we can do. So the cool thing about this power trail actually is it's in the shape of a dollar sign. Uh, you guys can see right here on the bottom right of the corner of the screen here. So I don't think I'll do all 70, I think of them are. It's like 50 or 70 uh, caches. So I'm just gonna do the 15 for today. It's great weather, but uh, I just don't think I have the energy or the time to do 70 caches today. Whoopsie. So if you guys remember a past video, uh, we have what's called Arizona State Trust Land out here, which is basically just kind of protected lands, uh, desert terrains that, you know, they're never probably going to build on. Um, and they limit, like, who can have access to them and stuff. I mean, not really limit, like, you can, anyone can go, you just got to buy a permit. And I have a permit, but my truck's parked here, and I don't have my permit parking pass on my dash, which I need to post right here. So, that way, in case anybody comes up to my vehicle, it's not, I don't get in trouble. foul odor over there and I'm worried make my way to uh, one of the curved parts of the uh, money symbol and I came across this and this is the most fascinating thing and probably one of the most fascinating things I've seen out here in the desert. Look at this saguaro growing like inside this tree. Probably pal very true, but like how crazy is that? 
I've never seen anything like that before. It's so cool. Really fascinating. Okay, here's the second most uh, interesting thing I ever saw out here in the desert. It's like cactus that split. And, like all these pieces just kind of split across like this. Interesting. Alright, after a lengthy walk from the previous cache to this one, because uh, there's no actual, I mean, there's some little bitty bitty trails here, but there's no actual like main trail like the other ones were along. So I kind of just go by the way the crows fly across the desert, watch my steps for everything, and just now hopefully at ground zero for uh, number 10 of the day, I think. Do my math. But yeah, I think this is number 10. Alright, there it is. <laughs> All right, there we go. I'm gonna go and count and see where we're at. All right, so yes, that was number 10, which means I'm five away from number 700, and it's uh, kind of way back to the truck, so uh, let's hopefully we can get to it. So this right here is number 699 caches found. One left, uh, and it ends up close to where I parked, so I kind of did like a little bit of a, like a letter D, I guess, capital D, uh, finding the caches to start on the money symbol. Like I said, I'm not doing the whole thing today. Uh, it's already almost 10.30, and I've been out here since eight o'clock, so it's definitely been quite a trek, but 699, number 700, is in our sights. Okay. We are approaching ground zero for cash number 700. And I'm pretty sure I see it in my sights. How bad would it be if there was no cash there? All right, guys, number 700. 700 caches I've now found in my geocaching career. So I want to thank you very much for coming up with me on this adventure today, find number 700, or any of my other previous, you know, 699 caches that I've found on this channel over the years. I do appreciate the support, I appreciate the viewership and the comments. I'm, I'm being more involved and I like commenting back to you guys, so please, you know, leave me comments down below. I love talking back and forth to the community and uh, just getting to know people. It's definitely has put me into a mindset for 2020 and I think I have something in mind, so I'll do a separate video on that, but until next time, uh, go ahead and check out some other videos right here on the right side of your screen. Also hit the subscribe button you haven't already down below, which is just below me here. Uh, so you don't miss out any of my geocaching adventures. Until next time, my name is Jason. Watch the cache. See ya.